these mysterious creatures live on almost all continents. At a meeting with them, few people will find it pleasant. In the course of evolution, they have acquired a lot of incredible abilities, which significantly distinguishes them from other creatures. Hello everyone, you are on the Beautiful Creatures channel, and today, we will look at snakes in action. But first, as usual, let's all subscribe to the channel together and press the bell so as not to miss something interesting. Make yourself comfortable, we're about to start. There are currently over 3,000 species of snakes, and they inhabit every continent except Antarctica. So it's very easy to accidentally encounter them, but only a quarter of them are poisonous, which, however, is also quite a lot. The variety of shapes and sizes of snakes is amazing, they can be quite small. No more than a worm or a little more and reach a length of 7 m and a weight of 100 kilograms. It is not clear why, but many people think that snakes do not have a spine, so they are so flexible, but this, of course, is not so snakes have not only a spine, but also ribs, the number of which can reach 400 pairs, and not very flexible and able to stretch. When the snake had a big meal. The snake is an excellent hunter, but they do not hear the prey at all, because they are completely deaf. Yes, and the vision cannot be called very good, but all because there are glasses on the eyes of special transparent scales that protect the eyes from dust. Therefore, snakes never blink and even sleep with their eyes open. But there is also a drawback in this process of molting. The snake becomes almost completely blind and tries to spend this time somewhere in a safe place. But the snake's sense of smell is well developed, while all smells are determined using a forked tongue. The snake sticks out its tongue, catching tiny particles in the air that tell if prey is nearby. Then the information enters the brain through the organs of Jacobson, in which there are two holes. As you guessed, each part of the snake's tongue falls into its own hole and transmits data. Some snakes are also thermally sensitive. These are the so-called pit vipers, which include vipers, rattlesnakes, and some others. So, they have two pits on their heads with thermal locators that capture the smallest changes in the temperature of objects. Thanks to this, the snakes are able to unmistakably determine the object of attack in its absolute darkness. All snakes are predators and you definitely cannot call them gourmets. Snakes attack any prey they can swallow, and in this case they succeeded like no other. The jaws of snakes have a very unusual structure, they have the so-called movable skull, in which all the bones are connected by elastic ligaments. This allows it to swallow prey much larger than the snake itself. In addition, the left and right parts move independently of each other, which helps to push the prey through the snake's esophagus just like a stocking wraps around the victim and swallows it. But this is rather a necessity, since snakes do not have teeth that can grind and chew food. Thanks to this feature, the snake can go without food for a long time, and some snakes can eat only 9 to 10 times a year. When did you last eat? Let's take a look at the snake in action, and we'll start by hunting frogs. In this video, a small snake grabbed a rather large frog by the paw and is about to eat it. At first it seems that the prey will be too tough for him, but slowly he is doing his job. He has already captured both hind legs, and it is almost impossible to escape from such a mouth. Gradually, the whole frog ends up in the snake's mouth, and as if nothing had happened, he crawled further. And here the snake was seduced by a huge toad and attacked it. She grabbed the prey by the head and tries to swallow it. But the toad is so big that it doesn't want to get into the mouth. Then the snake has nothing to do. How to release the caught prey? The frog survived and was almost unharmed. 
Snakes often attack lizards, they have no protection, and the main thing here is to choose the right size of prey in the video. The snake did not calculate its strength a little and grabbed a rather large lizard. It is not clear how she is going to swallow her prey if the lizard, ignoring the snake, can crawl up the wall. After several minutes of confrontation, this snake had to let go of the prey, but in fairness such situations occur quite rarely. And usually snakes accurately determine the size of prey. Here the snake has attacked the lizard and is preventing it from escaping. She presses it with her body and grabs her head to make it easier to swallow this lizard. No luck, and after a few minutes she finds herself in the mouth of a snake. Some species of snake hunt the branches of trees, and they do it very successfully. There you can catch a gaping bird or find someone's nest, as, for example, this viper attacked the nest and killed all the chicks. Unfortunately, such cases are not uncommon. And here the woodpecker was returning home, only someone else liked his dwelling, a huge green snake protrudes from the hollow, which tries to grab the woodpecker, but the woodpecker also does not miss and begins to peck it with its beak, trying to expel forces. Here they are unequal and the snake succeeds in grabbing a woodpecker. But he still breaks out of the mouth to drive the snake away, he did not succeed, but the bird should be given credit for its courage. The big king snake is not poisonous, but its food is very even the snake loves to eat other snakes, often poisonous, and for this you need to act very quickly. After all, her target today is a rattlesnake. Using more advanced reflexes, the king snake clamps the jaw of the rattlesnake before it even opens them. Now the prey needs to be eaten for the snake wraps its strong body around the prey and begins to swallow the long narrow body of the victim, and the missing paw fits perfectly into the stomach of the snakes. Snakes can even attack such dangerous predators as moray eels in the video. A sea snake attacked a moray eel and grabbed her by the head. The main weapon of the moray eel is a large mouth and sharp teeth, so now she has nothing to fight back, and meanwhile the snake begins to swallow its prey. Gradually, the whole moray eel is in the paste. There will be no such attack. Surprisingly, snakes can also prey on fish. For example, here a snake grabbed a huge sama and pulled it into shallow water, where it is more convenient to deal with prey. At first it seems too big for such a snake, but she is not going to give up the snake grabs the fish by the head and starts to push it. It looks scary, but in the end the sun hides its face in its mouth. This food will last her for a long time. And this is a squirrel that is not at all afraid of a huge snake. Moreover, she not only does not run away, but also tries to bite the snake's tail. The squirrel dodges the snakes and lunges at her when she tries to hide. The snake is no longer trying to fight back, but just wants to crawl away, but the squirrel does not lag behind. It remains only to guess what caused this behavior of the rodent. Sometimes snakes attack such dangerous animals as porcupine. They are well armed and don't just give up. The porcupine will defend itself to the last, using its sharp quills. But if the snake still manages to eat the porcupine, then most likely this will be its last meal. This is what a snake that swallowed a porcupine looks like. And here a huge python strangled a calf. A cow becomes furious and tries to trample the snake, and she tramples on it with her hooves, butts with her horns, and does not pay any attention to the snake's attempts to attack. Unfortunately, large snakes prey on large prey. And this centipede is a dangerous ruthless predator, about which there is a video on the channel.
but today it will turn from a hunter into a prey. Therefore, the attacks of the centipede are not terrible for her. But how she swallows a centipede so easily remains a mystery to me. Honey Badger and another lover of snakes, with huge claws and powerful teeth. And he is also famous for his immune system, which allows you to endure even the bites of such snakes as a cobra for your favorite snake. He will easily climb a tree and throw it out of there. Pythons can even attack caimans and crocodiles. They wrap themselves around the prey and begin to choke it, and crocodiles have not so many chances in such a fight. Very often, the snake emerges victorious in such a fight and swallows the prey whole. That's all, I hope you liked the video, rate it with your like and comment. So spit all snake lovers, and I say, goodbye.